How do you recommend Catholic men and women spend time together in groups? Uh, one thing I would say is that uh, think of it, the, the main things for a date to go well. Now, obviously a group date doesn't need to be formally a date, but when I talked to uh, women and when we were writing the dating blueprint book, we surveyed tons of them asking them like, what do you wish guys knew about dating? And the, the main thing that girls said that should be the two main ingredients of a date would be that it's fun and that you have time to communicate and get to know each other better. Those are the two main things the women wanted on a date. We're having fun. It's not some super high pressured four hour romantic riverboat cruise. No, just, just having fun. Like, uh, you know, Crystal and I are thinking of the next date we want to go ax throwing because we heard there's like some ax throwing bar restaurant and, you know, here in Arizona, I'm like, that'd be fun. You know, go have a glass of wine and just throw some axes at a wall. I mean, that, that sounds like fun. And so make it fun. It could be a tailgate party at your university. Um, make it fun. So it's not super high pressure. Um, the less alcohol, the better. Uh, I, don't, I don't recommend just like going to a party together, like have it focused. And, and if the group is like, I don't know, what do you want to do? You be the one to initiate. Why don't we go bowling? Why don't we go to this fun place? And it doesn't have to be something you're even good at. Like let's go ice skating and just fall all over the place. Like just go to a place that would say that's, that's fun without the contamination of drunkenness and drugs and all that other stuff that's likely to happen, um, and, and a place where you can communicate. Just get to know this person a little bit better. No high pressure, keep it simple, make it fun, and then you really get to see this person's personality. Like, because you'll notice, like, you might think you know a person, and then you watch them, like, play a sport, and it's like, they turn to like this incredible Hulk, Hulk anger, you know, issues person. It's like, wow, you know, I didn't know they got so worked up about this kind of stuff. And so spending time with others in fun, in service, um, in, in prayer and group environments and all these things really gets to see the full picture of that person. And so yeah, group dates, I always say it's an awesome idea. Hey there, I hope you enjoyed that little clip, but if you wanna see the whole episode where this came from, just click the link here. And in the meantime, we wanna invite you to help us share this message. And there's a couple things you can do real quick. Number one, if you like or comment or share this video, YouTube will actually show it to more people. Also, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell. We release videos every single day and you'll be notified as soon as those come out. If you want to help us also to spread this message, you can support us at patreon.com slash Jason Everett. That helps us to create these videos and show them to the whole world. God bless.